Hey welcome, to another After Effects tutorial. So today, we are going to learn some basic 3D animation inside After Effects, of course, without using any third party plugins. Let's start. Open After Effects, start with new project, create new composition. Keep default settings, and hit OK. Let's import some icons. Here, I have already created icons in Adobe Illustrator, you can also create it, using pen tool in After Effects. Let's convert it into shapes. Right click, go to create, and select create shapes from vector layer. Let's delete this, as we need only this shape layer. Right click, and create new shape layer. Let's create a rectangle shape. Resize it, and align it to center. Cool. Also let's change the color of shape. Let's adjust this a bit. This looks good to me. Now select pan behind tool, and move anchor point to center of each layer. Cool. Now, select these layers, and enable this 3D layer. Now, click here, and change renderer, to Cinema 4D. And hit OK. Cool. Click on this layer, and explore it. Explore geometry options. And increase its extrusion depth to 80. Also, click on this shape layer, and press P. And adjust its Z position properties. Cool. Right click and create new solid layer. Choose color you want. Now, right click and create a new camera layer. Select this camera tool and move this a little. Cool. Now, click on that, and create an empty group. Now again click on that, go to side, and select color. Choose color you want. Let's adjust this icon position by adjusting its Z axis. This looks good to me. Click on this icon shape layer, click on that, and create an empty group. Now again click on that, go to side, and select color. Choose color you want. Also, explore geometry options, and increase its extrusion depth to 50. You can adjust its position using Z axis. Cool. Also using this, parent it to this shape layer. Now let's animate this. Click on this shape layer, and press R, it will open up rotation properties. Click stopwatch of this Y rotation, and create keyframe. Now rotate its value to someone like this. Now, again restore it to original position to create a bounce effect. Select these keyframes and easy ease them. Go to graph editor. And just play around with this graph curves, to adjust speed of this animation.
This looks good to me. Select the shape layers, and pre-compose it. Press Ctrl plus D, and duplicate this layer. Also, let's adjust the scale of this pre-compose layer, and place it here. Go to Effects and Presets, and search for Fast Box Blur. And drag it to this layer. Set Blur Radius to 165. Again search for Fill, and drag it to this layer. Also choose its color to black. Now click on this layer, and press E, and change its opacity value to 70%. Cool. Let's preview this. Awesome. This way we have created a simple 3D animation inside After Effects. If this tutorial helped you, press the like button, and subscribe for more new contents every week. See you in next tutorial, stay tuned.